Do you feel the pressure? Hey guys, think Calp here. <laughs> hey guys, think Calp here. Just wanted to take the time to sit down with you and show you how to set up the Razer Ripsaw video capture card with Astro A40 headset on the PlayStation 4. The program I use on the computer is OBS Studios. I will have links down below in the details on where to purchase all these items. The next thing we're going to do, guys, is open up the Razer Ripsaw video capture card box and go through the instructions. So let's open the box up, and uh, I found the instructions. They're garbage. They're pretty much good for shit tickets. You guys aren't going to want to use those instructions. Uh, the best way to go through this, guys, is continue watching the video that you will see following this. Um, when I opened up and unboxed it, I thought, hey, great, this thing looks awesome. There's instructions. There's going to be tons of detail. But once I scoured Google, I went through YouTube, couldn't find a thing. Everybody's using the Elgato HD60 video capture cards. I wasn't a big fan of them. I actually prefer the Razer Ripsaw myself. That's why I went out and purchased that. Um, I think it's a far superior capture card. It's just not the popular one right now. So there's not a lot out there. So that's why I decided to come out with this video to help all you guys to set this thing up. So the next thing we'll do, guys, is show you how to hook up the cables and everything into your Razer Ripsaw video capture card. Okay, guys, so what we have here is the Razer Ripsaw video capture card. Um, as I previously mentioned in the video, um, Razer has really bad instructions on how to set this capture card up. So what I would recommend you guys do before you even start plugging this thing in is head over to uh, the Ra Razer's website download the Razer Synapse program. Um, you'll need that program to get this thing up and running. Otherwise, you'll plug it in and uh, you'll be wondering why nothing happens. So I will include a link to that in the details on the video for you guys to download. So after you've downloaded that Razer Synapse program, you guys are gonna take the video capture card. Um, one thing I actually did is I pre-ran all my cords. So I've got uh, an HDMI cord here going to the PlayStation. I've also got an HDMI cord going to my TV, and that's for the playthrough. And that will send the signal from the PlayStation through the capture card and straight to the TV. Also, what I did is I also have my um, USB 3.0 cord ran, and you're going to run that to the blue port on your computer. So there's a standard USB 2.0 port, which is white. You're going to want to run this to the USB 3.0 port on your computer, either on the front, the top, the back, wherever you have that, and that is in blue. So I do recommend running that ahead of time. Um, the other thing I have ran is the audio cord that goes to my uh, Astro A40 headset. So I recommend pre-running the cords, having them up here, then it's easier to plug everything in from there. So what you guys will also see on the back is I have HDMI out, HDMI in, I have component and then also my USB 3.0. And then just here on the front, I also have mic. So you guys might want to run a studio mic, something like that. You'll plug that into the capture card as well as an auxiliary in. So first thing here, guys, is we're going to go and plug the HDMI out into the back here. It just plugs in nice and easy like that. Then we'll do our HDMI in like that. I'll plug the USB 3.0 in in a second. So on the front under the auxiliary, which is going to be the far left of the Razer Ripsaw video capture card, you're going to plug your mic in. And then on the very back here is that USB 3.0. Once this is plugged in, because you've already plugged in and pre-ran your cords, you're going to see a red light pop up. And that red light's just saying that it's not working right now. It does take a couple seconds. You'll see that pop up to green, and there you guys go. So when that light goes green, that means the capture card is doing exactly what it needs to do. It's got power going to it from the computer, um, and that Razer Synapse program you already have up and running, so it should link through to that. If it doesn't, you may have to refresh, something like that. So that's basically a quick uh, idea, guys, of how to set up that Razer Ripsaw video capture card. Um, the next thing you guys are going to want to do after this auxiliary is plugged in, is then set up your Astro A40 headset. So what you'll do on the Astro A40, and it comes with an audio mixer. So this audio mixer has a whole bunch of cords on it, a little bit confusing. So first things first, we have uh, 
On the very bottom here, um, you'll see they have uh, a link area where you can actually link these mixers together. So say you have like 20 buddies over, you're throwing back some brewskis, wanting to play a little bit of Battlefield 1 or maybe some GTA 5. Um, you'll actually link this to each mixer so you guys can all be on the same chat audio so you don't have to do it through game chat. Um, the next one over is headset. Then we have a, a plugin which I think is a 2.5 mil if I'm correct to run to your controller. And then the far side again is another linking one to go to your uh, your buddy's mixer. So what we've done is we've plugged our headset into the bottom and that's going to run all the way up to your Astro A40s. And that's going to plug in right here on the very bottom. So you just plug that straight in and your headset's set up. It's good to go with mic, with sending audio to the headset. The next thing you'll want to do is flip this back around. And on the top here, you'll see we have an optical out mp3 stream and usb so optical out you're going to want to get a digital optical cord which the headset does come with that cord um, you'll plug that optical in on top of the mixer and then that optical in will run to the optical port on your ps4 and that's going to allow signal to be sent through uh, the next one's mp3 I wouldn't really worry about that. That's more for music. Um, I don't have it set up. I, I don't run music, so I couldn't explain too much more on that for you guys. Next one over is stream. So this stream cord is an important one. You're going to plug that cord into the top of the mixer, and that's the one that runs to the auxiliary port on the Razer Ripsaw capture card. And then the next one over is your USB. And that USB is going to plug into the top here. It's just a micro USB uh, cord on this end. The other end runs to your PS4, and that's going to go just in front. And that's just a standard USB 2.0, and that just plugs into the front of your PS4. And that is going to allow you to have power to the mixer, as well as send your chat audio and get some of your game audio coming through the headset as well. And uh, the nice thing, guys, just to touch on these uh, Astro A40s, is with this Pro Mixer, is what they call it, I have full audio control up top here on the knob. It's great for when you're playing, you can just reach down, easily turn that. Power, so you can turn your power on and off. A mixer here, so it just gives you different um, audio settings for bass, treble, mid-range, things like that. You guys can set that where you want. And then it also has a Dolby um, option, so you can turn Dolby on or off. And then at the bottom here is game and voice. So you can actually mix with how much incoming game sound you have versus uh, guys in your squad or other chat people in the game. So you can kind of put that where you feel like it works best for you. And the one thing I will touch on is that Dolby button. Um, you can have just a standard headset basically, or if you press the button, you'll get Dolby and you'll have full 7.1 surround, which is a mind blower on Battlefield 1. You can hear every little footstep. So. Yeah, guys, I've got um, got the capture card set up now. As you can see, it's still running green. All right, guys, so I'd like to take uh, the time to thank you guys for coming out, watching the video on how to set up the Razer Ripsaw capture card with the Astro A40 headset. Um, if you guys feel like you want to purchase any of those items, I will have links in the details down below. It's through Amazon, and uh, any purchase you guys do through those links helps support the channel. So thank you very much for taking the time to do that, guys. Also, if you're wondering, you know, I have a different setup, uh, I need to ask some questions, by all means, guys, feel free to uh, type those questions in the comments. I will get back to you as soon as I can with any help I can provide you guys. Um, if you like what you saw today, you want to see more, please like the video and uh, give me a subscription. Thank you guys for coming out today. We'll see you soon. Or put water in a can of Coke and just totally haul on the wrong part of it and just, cocksucker! Fuck mother bitch! All you hear on the video is beep 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 beep. You just be like, and all you see is beep 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 beep. beep. <laughs> Anyways, we should probably do the for real video. Pick her up, toss her again, bub. That was a good. Wake up. Hey, wake up. Jelly bean. What's up, guys? Tim Calb here. Just catching a little fucking snooze. Sorry. Almost really good. And then right there, you go slow-mo, black and white, thug life. Everybody does it all the time. Ugh, fuck. 
Hey guys, Think Calp here. Just wanted to take the time to show you guys how the fuck's sakes I'm going to laugh. Does it seem good? Okay. I need toilet paper. Are we recording? Yeah. Off. Oh. Hey guys, Think Calp here. Uh, just going to end up the video. <laughs> oh. Like, uh, I'll be singing the song, like, if you think I'm sexy and you know you want me, come on, baby, show me. Oh, fuck. Hey, how's it going, guys? You take the, yeah, you put the lime in the coconut and whatever, right? <laughs>